Hello. Okay, um, I'm going to be talking about, or discussing, or giving my opinion, um, and I would love to hear your opinion, because this is a discussion. Uh, let's see. About the Ruku. Now, it's really cool to be able to have more control over your life, in every way, in any way. It's just, there's a few key points, though, that you don't have control over it. That you, they still are using those tax, tactics of brainwashing or helpful suggestions depending on your out view or your view of it slash how much money you're going to make off of it because that's the point there's a point too of we're not money we're humans it's almost like we're trying to speak without realizing for money and have money be like the thing that it rules the world I'm not saying it kind of isn't I'm just saying we don't have to do that. <laughs> we can just speak for ourselves. But, you know, some people don't really love themselves that much and want to please others. Um, let me get back to the thing. I, what I want to say is, um, okay, well, I want to bring some points, though, that um, it's really uh, amazing that they have these favorite buttons. I mean, I think that's really smart and wise. It's just they're already pre-programmed they didn't tell you this in the box they just they're already pre-programmed you can't unprogram them so that's pretty much a no on mine and for me to, if I was choosing to get this that would be a no right there so I got one no already Okay, if they were being able to reprogram them so that they're actually fast buttons, for my liking, which would indicate that they're not so much for the money, that they actually care about me and what I want. They're actually trying to take care of me. If it was set up like that, then it would be a yes. Um... So since they're already pre-programmed, and they're helpful suggestions, I only get to use one of these buttons. So all of this technology, all these resources, are waste, essentially. Um, they could be used another way, or an unnecessary resource in my book, because I can't use any of these other buttons. And so why have them? Why even make it if I can't use it? So there's a no. Um, so, let's see. The volume, this, I have the Roku too, and there's the volume button. And it only works for when I have a headphone in there. It would be brilliant if it actually controlled the volume on the TV. So, this volume button is useless, um, essentially, or is an unnecessary resource, essentially, because if I use the headphones, it kills the battery super fast. Super fast. Like, it only lasts, like, four days. And then that's it. Then I go out, I gotta get more batteries. So, that's a no. Um... Let's see. Oh, yes. I like that you're able to get a whole bunch of channels. That's that's pretty cool. It's just some of the channels I sum up rinky dinky or something like that. They seem super low end. It's just there's a point where it's silly that they're like that. Like like the HBO.
you have to pay for it. And the things they do have on there for free are nothing. Same thing with sci-fi. It says it's free, except it's only the trailers. It's just the whole thing about the whole how the menu set up. Now, there was a point where there's no organization. So there's a no right there. Super time consuming to flip through all your 300 channels to get to that one. Or to find it. So the chances of you wanting to watch something on this or that is slim to none. Now the chances of you wanting to select one of these favorite buttons or fast track buttons or what it is are higher. So, there's a reason why it's like this. There's always a reason. It's just, it's silly that the reason is money, essentially. Because we're not money. We're humans. We're not money. There's a difference, but yet, some, everybody always bases it off of money. It's just, why not? Nevertheless, the whole how the menu is set up, it's kind of silly. It, why your your whole thing is take back your TV have control of your TV then why am I being forced to watch these ads on there and I can't change it there's no way of changing that now if I really was holding true to that statement without being super bogged down by money which pretty much is the reason why we have not flying cars and 21st century jets and kind of life is because of money or others that chose to use money in that way um, you should be able to delete like it's 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 amazing to be able to go online and go, I want this, this, and this. Or go on the Roku and say, I want this, and this, and this. Even though that's ridiculous because there's no search engine for the channels. It only searches for movies of the actors and whatever it searches for. It should be able to search for the channels on there too. When you go to the Roku site though, are you kidding me? Unless you took some time, like a couple hours, or you're really just kind of already able to key in to where it is you're gonna be lost because it's not set up at all at all easy to maneuver at all it, it's somewhat to a certain degree yet there's a lot of things you have to backtrack to get to you shouldn't have to backtrack to get to it it should just be on one central menu. Yet, how else would they get you distracted? Because there's a point where they are somewhat getting you distracted from everyday life, in a sense. Sometimes that's okay, and sometimes that's just rooting for the same team that's trying to control and saying that we have to have these fast track buttons and we have to have we have to have commercials to pay for TV. No, you don't. You just have, you can just have TV. Um, oh, and so you can only delete one thing on the Roku at one time. Yes, you specifically have to go on the Roku. Click a bunch of buttons they say oh it's because we don't want somebody to have your account password and then uh, be able to delete your stuff without you knowing well for one then why don't you have it set up with a different password 
to delete something so you can delete everything at one time um... Oh, and you used to be able to stream unlimited amount of things. Movies or whatever. Videos. Now it's only up to 15 minutes. I mean, that's kind of a point. The reason why I got the Roku was because I had this TV. An analog TV. And I wasn't really using it. And to me, if I don't really use something, I kind of just get rid of it. I don't hoard it. <laughs> I don't keep it. I don't... I mean, there's a point where I try to keep it and find a use for it and, um, if I can't, then give it to, like, Goodwill. Or I would, you know, I would love to have somebody give me money for it. Because then that would mean I'd be able to go off and barter or something else. It's just... There's a point where I don't care about getting that money for it. I just want it to be used. I don't want it to be put into a hole after we already dug it out of a hole. It's just... So I got that. I got the second one. Which is really cool because now you don't... You can have... If you lose your remote, you can go on your phone and get an app. And that's pretty cool. That part's really cool because I actually used that feature. Because I tried to take the batteries out and I did and it didn't work, so and I lost the batteries or whatever, and then I didn't have a remote. Even though I just got in the fridge, you got batteries. Regardless, it was pretty cool to be able to do that. Now that's an option. Now that's amazing. That's amazing. It's just okay. Well kind of got away for these no and yes things. It's just there's a point though that this Roku is really cool because you're able to stream things and you're able to get it on a bigger screen because potentially I was watching it on my phone screen. That's all I was watching. Netflix and stuff like that. Regardless, it's just why am I why are we limiting ourselves on this because of money because somehow that makes the world go round no the world just goes round by itself I mean there's a potential where it really is this ideal world that does make it go round it's just to the point where are we really going to keep saying that you own this resource when you're only going to use so much of it and then on top of that you denied somebody else from using that resource because you had to use all of it because you couldn't just recreate you you wanted to recreate the will why do we recreate the will every single time oh because we have to prove ourselves instead of working together I'm just saying. That was kind of my review of the Roku. Um, what's your discussion on the Roku? Where is it going to bring us? You know, what 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 are we looking at? Potentially in the future because we have this Roku thing. Overall, you enjoy your life. Be you. Because you're brilliant and wise and smart. Mm-hmm.